Well, I wasn't expecting this, but uh, yo boy got his stainless steel Egyptian God cards. No tracking, no nothing. They just came on in the mail. They said, hey, bro, you gonna finish that pizza? Let's dive on into it, shall we? Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it is your host with the very expensive wallet of the most, Avery LR32 here, and destroy the ever-living 25th anniversary boo-boo stain of that like and subscribe button as we climb even higher the 1400 ladder. Are we the first on YouTube to get this? I haven't seen anyone else talk about this, and literally just like 10 minutes ago, I got this big old box that was, it said TCG order or whatever it said, and... Um, Lo and behold, the God cards are in here. So it was actually wrapped up really nicely. I, I clearly couldn't film an unboxing because I didn't know I was getting the thing. Um, but to show you how it comes, this is like a little, uh, I don't know, plastic box piece. But you slide this off. You get a very nice, uh, it says, uh, trading card game stainless steel Egyptian God cards on the front. They do put some uh, cellophane wrap in here. You're not going to see it in here because... I already took it out, but to give you sort of like a mini unboxing, lo and behold, if we can pull this out, if I can move all this stuff in, and we have the stainless steel perfect timing with the Egyptian God cards, or with the Blue Eyes, is the manga art Egyptian God cards, if we could get these all in frame, and then of course, if you take a look at the back, they have the colors of each of the gods. These are absolutely gorgeous. Um, for those of you who maybe are new to the channel, haven't seen some of my other collection stuff, we obviously just got our briefcase the other day. Um, but I actually also have, in a similar steel casing, but much smaller, much less expensive, um, but I have the three ultra rare from the Game Boy game God cards um, that have like the Japanese text at the bottom. This card can't be used in a door or whatever. Um, but it's not the secret rare versions. It's the ultra rare versions, which they're still expensive. They're like 50 bucks a piece. And I remember my parents bought it for me when I was a kid for like 150. So I have that to go along with these. And this is just absolutely gorgeous. Now, obviously with these stainless steel Egyptian gods, you're not getting like new Egyptian God card support. We're not getting like a, a, a thing that all of a sudden out of the blue out of this. Now I haven't received an email or anything, and there was nothing in my package that showed whether or not I had won the vanilla black luster soldier. When you order up one of these, you are guaranteed um, a spot in the, uh, random giveaway for the vanilla black luster soldier, um, which there's only like one of those being given away. So if you win it, congrats, I guess I didn't win it. There was, like I said, nothing in the packaging. I'm surprised that I got it so quick. As far as I know, no one else has gotten theirs. Um, these are gorgeous though. Like I wouldn't even say that they're ultra rare. Like they look, they actually look like really different because when you shine it in the light, it might be kind of hard to see. Yeah, you can see the reflection kind of going up and down. It's, that's not like how a normal ultra rare looks, um, but I love the fact that it's still in the 25th anniversary steel case. Um, these are 400 bucks. I'm probably gonna turn around and sell mine for like five or 600. Uh, this is absolutely gorgeous. Definitely a collector's piece. Um, I think the blue eyes are definitely going to sell quicker than these. Cause I mean, these aren't playable, right? Like it's literally just the manga art from the original Duel Monsters. That's making me nervous. I'm gonna hold it like this. <laughs> but um, th th these aren't playable, right? Like the God cards are not a tier zero thing. This is just a massive collector's piece. I had to get it with the other God cards that I have. Um, I mean, I, I couldn't pass up on this, especially I think they knew that like this wasn't gonna be a hot piece unless they threw something else in with it. Hey, you have a chance to get a vanilla Blackluster Soldier that is legal for play, which is quite interesting. Um, but I, I guess I didn't win it. I'm not seeing anything here about it. But guys, I don't wanna waste too much of your time. I just wanted to show these off real fast. Hey, we got it. It looks absolutely gorgeous. And um, yeah, we're gonna go put it up in the collection. So guys, let me know what you think. Have you gotten yours yet? Is this the first on YouTube? Guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.